Hello everybody, Ministorm here. Welcome back to Stellaris, the cultist campaign. In the last episode, we continued working on getting the fleet rebuilt, as we have been for a little while. We're also working on establishing new colonies, as we have been for the last couple of episodes. We're going to be continuing to work on that project to get all the rest of the habitable planets in our borders colonized. We also got a new, um, Ascension perk, which is the word I'm looking for. Then we are now have Voidborn so that we can build orbital habitats to continue to expand our control over our territory and our population and get more stuff. So, yeah, continuing to work. Um, the Panori are at war with the Republic and allies. The Aquilese are at war. I am definitely considering ending our mutual defense treaty with the ISK. Because the last thing I want to do is be dragged into another major war uh, without my, you know, you know, without my control. So, yeah. Still thinking about that one. Because really, we don't want to be at war at all if we can avoid it. I haven't got the new science ships. They're going to be setting up for assisting research so that we can get the research done quicker. Now, actually, we go ahead and unpause it. Let's get it moving. And we have a colony ship built and out. Let's see, make sure that's colonizable. Let's go ahead and send... Send out another colony ship. Oh, that's the one we are sending our colony ship to. Bog World. Hmm. Glacial World. Well, let's just pick the next one in line. And let's see... No, no, no. Um, our people don't like this at all. So we're going to have to send somebody else. You guys have Tomb World preference. Guess you'll do. Alright, let's uh, crank the speed up here. What's our cap for alloy alloys? Twenty-five thousand. I 
I was thinking selling some slaves. No, I think they're too useful as workers. Now, Yari Commerce League has declared the Angelic Republic their rival. I think probably we'll just do is continue to establish branch offices as much as we can. I still have that that truce. Twenty three ninety four five twenty nine. So less than a year. There's a new colony. Let's get blockers cleared. Market leader is currently the Angelic Republic. Hmm. Automatic trades. Now, nah, I think I'll do it manually. So what I might be doing is looking for um, more traditions next time we have an available tradition, which is going to be, uh, we'll see how long here in a moment. Just a moment. Seventy six months till we get our next tradition. We're looking for ones that reduce 
The fee on the market. Let's see, prosperity. How does this do? Construction complete. Upkeep reduced. Special style put increased. City so districts provide an additional clerk job. City so districts provide additional housing. Now that seems like a nice mining station output has increased by 10%. Let's see. Give our planets one merchant job per 50 pops. That seems like a good tree to take. So you already have commerce. Yeah, we'll probably have to go after prosperity next. So I think it makes the most sense for what we're trying to do. Industry. Construction complete. Kind of conglomerate entered into a non aggression pact with the Isk Galactic Republic. Well, let's buy what I can. Not something I want right there. Let's go ahead and get a civilian industry building. get a couple of them going. Let's see. Establish a branch office here. Um, get our concealed drug labs going, get our illicit research labs going, and get a wrecking yard going. There's 0% crime here, so that's... That's going to be a slight issue. And that's where a large portion of their army's hanging out.
Ah, that looks better. Get those concealed drug labs going. Yeah, the Kadeshi kind of control the Aqualese over there. Establish a whole bunch of branch offices. Oh, there we go. We got some crime here. Uh, we've burned through our minerals. Oh, excuse me. See. The minerals are cheap. Alright. Let's get the same thing. Concealed drug labs, illicit research labs, and wrecking yards. There we go. Now here we have workers that are unemployed. We'll continue to make commercial zones. I have 3.8 thousand alloys. Now one thing I wish that it would tell me is what it's actually going to build. When I click that button. Complete. Let's see, this is the Shimini Starfleet. What do you have left that you need? Let's see, a battleship. Oh, well, both battleships. And both dreadnoughts. See, how expensive are these dreadnoughts? So I want to get one of these built. Because we haven't gotten any dreadnoughts built yet. You cost 4400 4100 Now what I could do is manually build one. Construction. I want one of those. I need 325 
alloys. There's 250. And if we wait a month... There we go. We'll manually build it in 700 days. And then we'll merge it in. So we have our carriers, we have our battle cruisers. Next colony is ready. Let's go ahead and clear those blockers. All right, no new buildings in our branch offices. 100%, 100%, 100%, 80%, 35%, 18%. 3%. That's a little low. But I'm not sure there's much else I can do. Because I've got kind of the maximum crime producing buildings there. Let's see, it looks like the patrol pl the, the, the patrol fleets. Strike cruisers. You don't have any strike cruisers, but that's okay. So this guy's at full strength. <clears throat> no, no, it's not. I need strike cruisers. Okay. We've been insulted by the Lelorobius Galactic Hierarchy. Well. Fine then. And there's the Panori getting their butt kicked again. Border friction, border friction, their claims on us. Slavery policy, our rival, rivals with allies. And they don't like the fact that I'm a criminal syndicate. Yeah, well. What does it want to build? How expensive are those strike cruisers? Pretty expensive. Now you actually still need some Corvettes. I mean, we could potentially build those. I 
Oh well, we'll just let the minerals build up, or alloys build up. There is zero crime here. Um, let's see if we can't get some crime going here. Sixty-eight pops in that tomb world. And some crime. Good. Same thing. Wrecking yards and the illicit research labs. Keep them coming. And I think we're out of influence. So we'll need to let that build back up. Okay. research goes. 12 months for our new reactors. Still 97 months for our flagship tech. But then that's the, the ultimate warship that we'll have. I think. Construction complete. Did we ever actually design the Titans? No, but it's basically a, a dreadnought. But let's go ahead and uh, get this thing designed here. Annihilator bow. Yeah, that's what I want. Um, artillery core, artillery core, artillery stern. Yeah, that all looks like what we want. We want tachyon lances. Point defense. Actually, do we have any, like, carrier? No. Alright, what do I want here? I'd like some neutron launchers. Do I want null void beams? Probably some. To rip down the uh, the shields. Cause let's see, these guys do what? On armor damage, shield damage. Branch office shut down on Gab Gabbog. Okay. Yeah, that was the one I think that we were going to be in trouble with. Um, yeah, let's go with the null void beams, and then we'll just spam the gamma lasers on the rest. Oh, except that 
It won't. It won't let me put anything in that block. There we go. Auto complete the design. Ship design does not have a name. It's a Tanya class. Sure, why not? Save it. Colonization in progress. Get rid of that old design. Delete that. Actually, we do need to make some adjustments here. We need accuracy. Sensor range, no. Um, fire rate and weapon damage. Daily uh, damage control team seems good. Titan command network. Effect on own fleet. Yeah, we probably want one Titan per fleet. It makes the whole rest of the fleet better. Construction complete. So it acts as kind of a command and control ship, but there's sixty eight hundred. To make. And I don't know if we'll have the naval capacity for it. I could upgrade the station to a citadel. There we go. Alright, but I think we're at the end of the episode here. Dreadnought's coming along. Ugh. It annoys me that we have to let these guys fly through our territory. Oh well. I could beat that fleet if I had to. All right, but yeah, we'll go ahead and end the episode here. So for now, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.